Rose and, and, and uh, Troy. I thought he was uh, number five. What, oh, you four and he's five? I think so. Is that okay? It's been and a while like, since I checked. And then who's third? I think was Seth third was Enoch, actually. It would definitely be Zach now. Zach and then Seth. And I'm honorable mention that it's Zach. I'd probably say, then it'd probably be you, then Toodles. And then between Drake and Mickey, I would say after that, kind of hard to say. Um, a lot of people get bit. Wow, great godlike punish there um, from Kevin Falcon. This is a really beneficial matchup uh, for Falcon to, to abuse his like you know aerial mobility. Um, Samus is kind of tough to combo for a lot of characters, but Falcon is just so fast, and he has such a he has so many uh, aerial aerials that he can do like low knockback for you know combo extender and combo starter, and then he's got you know knee back air great combo finishers. Um, so you know, once you get that, once you get Samus up in the air, you know, with a grab or with a, like a like a, a down air, you can definitely just keep those punishes going. Great punish on the wave dash back with a short hop knee there as well. Just tag chasing him all over the stage. Okay, so Beef Beef kind of getting overwhelmed a little bit, but I know uh, he's definitely a, a very a resistant player, and he will. He's the type to you know, if he feels like he's getting rushed out, he'll slow it. He'll slow the match down a little bit. Try and make you play at his pace. Maybe zone with some projectiles and uh, you know crouch cancel, crouch cancel pretty efficiently. Oh Jacob, oh what's up, buddy? Yeah, good, to, good to, uh, to see you around. I'm super, super glad you popped the stream chat for a little bit. Hope everything's going well in life. Hope you're still watching some anime. Me and Ashley are like a hundred episodes into uh, shipping in right now. And just uh, now getting to the good stuff. Thanks. I know, dude. Honestly, it's been amazing so like the entire time. But uh, I'm still, I'm still. I'm traumatized. I'm traumatized. From the ending of... Uh, There's just a really huge... I, I don't want to say anything on, on commentary, but... Uh, can you wave shine Samus? Yeah, you can absolutely wave shine Samus with Fox. Um, but it is, it's a little bit tougher... I know, Drake. It's a little bit tougher than a lot of characters because... Um, she uh, she goes she can go really far from your shine with uh, with just her you know di way and SCIing the shine makes it oh, extremely it's, it's very difficult. hard very tight to get in there uh, nice extender I like that I like that as a mix up but Falcon staying airborne makes it impossible for that extender to connect um, it just extends the ground hitbox. yeah I'm still in, I'm still in bracket I, it's me and Dr Poonani in winners finals coming up here. Probably after this set, actually. Um, yeah, that'll be best of five as well. So definitely stay, stick around for that one. So Beef is making it a little bit closer, but just kind of just struggling to, uh, you know, maintain uh, stage control. And, it, and in turn, it's going to be really difficult to even up this deficit. How much harder than Falcon? Uh, a good bit harder than Falcon. Yeah, yeah. Falcon Falcon has really low traction, so it's real or high traction. He's combo food. Yeah, so he, he does not go uh, a very long distance away from from Fox whenever he gets shine. Where Samus goes really far. She uh, she slides. So But yeah, Falcon Samus, like I said, all about the grab game really and just you know, with punishing Samus with uh, you know, anytime she throws out a, a projectile, you can definitely, you know, full hop over it or you know, dash a power shield. And then uh, grab uh, your Nair also with Falcon and Knee will both destroy projectiles. Man, I love the way Toodles plays. He's not even uh, spamming grab all that frequently. He's mostly just kind of, um, he's reading a lot of wave dash backs. He's like punishing uh, Samus' defensive tools really well. He's applying a lot of shield pressure too, which is kind of hard to do with Falcon. Yeah, Because they, they risk uh, up the out of shield, but I haven't seen Beef do it very much. Mm -hmm. I would say Beef has gone for a lot of like grabs out of shield, and that is the number one thing you want Samus to do as Falcon because it's really easy to uh, set up a punish. Yeah, say say you do a, a late uh, fastball knee on Samus shield, and then just spot dodge, and she grabs. She's just open for you know a grab for a down air for a knee, pretty much anything you want. Um, Beef tending to go to the corners of the level. Yeah, I think it's a Samus thing, man. I think Samus just wants a lot of Samus just want that space. You know? Yeah, absolutely. they want to try and control neutral, but they don't know how to do it aggressively. Right, right. And uh, the, the thing about retreating to the corner of Samus is you, you're kind of giving up, uh, you know, one of your best tools, which is wave dash back, right? Wave dash back mm -hmm. to punish like an aggressive aerial from Falcon. You can uh, wave dash back, crouch cancel, down smash, right, or down tilt, or down tilt. Yeah, and get huge, huge combos off of it. So if you if you put yourself in the corner, you're kind of uh, you know denying yourself room to wave dash back. So it's kind of like okay, all you can do is wave dash forward and shield, 
you, your full hop is going to get punished. Uh, so I don't know about this. Uh, this is not a good stage for Samus. The other thing is, you know, you get yourself in the corner of Samus, and uh, you know, you get need by Falcon in the corner. You're going to die really early. A little bit of an SD coming out there from Toodles. So Beef kind of getting a free lead. Let's see if he can actually hold on to it, or if he's just going to get stomped on the platform. Okay, okay. Escapes. I don't. Uh, I definitely don't like the stage for Samus. So like she 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 lives long as a character, right? Yeah. But you, you, you want prefer... to counter pick a stage where you live even longer. Indeed. You want to have six lives to their four. I would say in terms of uh, you know what Samus gets out of this stage, she probably gets the same benefits with uh, you know a few extra benefits from like fountain. You still get a big wall to ride and wall jump off of. You still get really tiny horizontal uh, blast zones, so your F smash and up tilt will kill early. Um, but you have the added benefit of not dying off the top nearly as soon. Mm, good wow. catch with a double jump there. Which I guess Falcon doesn't really kill off the top. He's mostly going to kill horizontally, mm -hmm. but that's Yoshi's... Why I, that's why I would much prefer to go to, to, to maybe uh, Dreamland yeah. or maybe even FD, honestly. I was thinking FD, but then again, you know, you up throw Samus on FD with Falcon, and it's just, yeah, it's just you just up air infinitely. She just cannot... Uh, can't really get, can't really get back down. Ledge, the uh, the yeah, I'm playing tonight. Team. I'll uh, I think I'm gonna be on stream next in winners finals against uh, Dr. Poonani. But uh, yeah, Toodles really running away with this lead. I do think that uh, Yoshi's might not be Yoshi's might not be the, the the best because I feel like Samus is dying really early and like like Emperor was saying, wow, destroy those shy guys. But like Emperor was saying, you really want to abuse the fact that you're a tanky character with Samus and you want to live a really long time and kind of kind of frustrate your opponent. Mm -hmm. um, Tire them out, really. Yeah, exhaust. Play the long game. Yeah. Mentally exhaust them to the point that you know they're more willing to make mistakes. They're more willing to aggress in like a, a less calculated fashion. Um, yeah. Kind of bait them into doing things that they wouldn't would normally do. Right, and that's yeah. when your crouch cancels are going to be more powerful. Your wave dashes back are going to be more powerful. That's crazy. Uh, and Ubby's out of shield as well. I think Ubby out of shield. I, I hope he goes back and watches this set because I think the number one thing that I'm noticing is just you know kind of cornering himself and also just not abusing um, Falcon attacking your shield uh, very safely. Um, especially a fast faller, right? Monthly and a fast faller, if a fast faller uh, does an aerial on a shield, it's very easy to punish them without being out of shield. Yeah. No, I probably won't. I probably won't go to versus Huntsville tomorrow. Unfortunately, Ooh, I'm, that's I'm, a drop. I'm actually. Yeah, I'm gonna house sit for my boss this weekend. So I'll probably just kick it around around Troy, play with play with all the guys around here. Um, but I'll, if you guys stream, I'll definitely be in the in the chat. Rooting on the boys. Tell Marshall I said what's up. Shy guy saving beef there from uh, four throw kill. Okay, it's not undoable actually right here for Samus. Um, she does have like a kind of unfortunate Ooh. SD. He's at 55. Little... Yeah, man. Another couple of uh, missiles and he's dead. Let's see, he's in the corner, but at that point, you know, Falcon's across the level. Uh, oh, wow. Good. good movement there from, from Toodles. Beef making it respectable though. Definitely definitely saying, okay, I'm no slouch. You know, you had the SD, so I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna at least gonna threaten this uh, this game through right here. Good